A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, I want A plus English, that's so much fun, English education, for you and everyone, so come along. Learn some grammar, hey. learn a phrase, uh -huh. learn something new every day, learn the A plus way. Hello and welcome to A Plus Chicklin. Today we're talking about hip hop music. Awesome. I have to admit, I don't know much about hip hop music. Do you? Uh, maybe. Well, I have some friends that makes hip hop music. So, but I don't really know as much as they do. But I kind of know what it is like and what it what it sounds like. Yeah, I think I could identify if I heard some hip hop music. But what I do know about hip hop is that it has a really cool dance style、oh. that goes along with it called.、Mm -hmm. Break dancing. Oh yeah, super、Cute. cool, and those people are so talented.、Mm -hmm. Today's article is called "Hip Hop Gets the Party Started," and hip hop is a kind of music. And in today's article, we're going to look at the history of hip hop and the culture surrounding it. But before we do that, let's have a warm-up question. Chicklin, what's your favorite style of music? Why do you like it?、Mm, I think my favorite style of music is. More like jazz, like、mm. blues, soul, or a cafe, relaxing music,、super、music like that. Yeah, super yeah. cool music. Not like super cool, but yeah, yeah, we can say that. I think it's cool. Yeah. Okay. What about you? I like jazz music too.、Okay. It's really good music for like studying or working、mm -hmm. too.、Uh, but outside of that, probably pop music or、oh, yeah. maybe country and folk music too. Oh, I like country music. Yeah,、mm -hmm. um, pop music, especially if I'm. You know, going out with friends or going to a party—it's good to dance to some pop music.、Mm -hmm. You guys can think about this question too. Which kind of music do you like, and can you explain why? But for now, let's get into our article about hip hop. Hip hop gets the party started. Warm-up question: What's your favorite style of music? Why do you like it? Hip hop is a style of music and a way of life. Hip hop culture. Has four important elements: music, parties, art, and dance. The music people, DJs, bring hip hop to people's ears. They each have their own style and music tricks. They all keep people dancing, though. The party people, MCs, keep the party going. They get people excited by using the DJ's music. And their own rhymes. The art. Graffiti is a style of street art. Graffiti artists use colorful paints to show how they feel. The dance. Break dancing is a dance style that was created for hip hop music. B boys and B girls use their strength and creativity to blow people away. The article begins with "Hip hop is a style of music and a way of life." Ooh, so it's more than just music; it's、mm -hmm. a way of life. We'll talk about that phrase later, but first, let's talk about the word style. Style 就是风格的意思，所以其实我们有一个片语，你可以说是某人的作风，就是 be someone's style。比如说 ，I never ask a man out; it's not my style。我从来都不约男生出去，这不是我的作风。或者是呢，像我们的发型，其实英文也是 hairstyle。所以，比如你前面加一个 hair 就可以成立了。比如说 ，His hairstyle hasn't changed。Much since he was eighteen, 他从八十八岁开始呢，之后发型就没有什么变化过。那我们再看一个风格 style 这个字的例句。I love the style of Nancy's house. It's simple but interesting. 我喜欢 Nancy 家的风格，虽然很简约，不过很漂亮，很可爱，很有趣。So what exactly is hip hop? 
Well, as we explained earlier briefly, it's a kind of music popular especially in the United States, and hip hop music often involves rapping, which is kind of like singing but speaking really quickly, and DJs who mix music together. Super cool.、Mm. So, as Chicklin explained, the word style is the particular way that something is designed or presented. There are different kinds of styles: music styles, architecture styles, and fashion styles.、Mm -hmm. You have a cool style, Chicklin. Ah,、oh, thank you. Are、mm -hmm. you talking about my looks? Or yeah, my, my, you, my, my everything. You always wear cool <laughs> clothes. Such style. Because I'm cool. I'm the cool kid. You are the cool kid. <laughs> That means I'm the nerd. No, you're not. Both of us are cool. Okay, we're cool kids. So this is a way of life, 对吧？生活方式的意思。所以其实 hip hop 这个是一种音乐风格，也是一种生活方式。So hip hop being a way of life, this phrase is used for something that's really important to you. So important that maybe you spend a lot of your time doing it. It's maybe one of the most important things in your life. You can say that that is your way of life. For me. Video games is a way of life. Oh yeah, I see you post about like video games all the time. All the time. <laughs> well, back to the article and more about hip hop. Hip hop culture has four important elements: music, parties, art, and dance. Hmm. So we see, wow, so many things. Let's look at this word. Element. Element has elements, or parts, or elements. Elements 有部分啊，或者是要素的意思。那其实这个字还有另外一个片语哦，叫做 be in one's element， 或者是 be out of some somebody's element， 指的就是做一件事情很得心应手，或者是甚至 out of 就是变成不适应。所以我们造一个句子试试看。Look how well he dances. You can tell he's in his element. 你看他跳舞跳这么好，你可以完全可以知道他真的是非常的擅长这件事情。那我们再看一个另外一个句子。This movie had all the elements of a good action movie. 这部电影呢，具备了一部优秀动作片所有的要素。So the word element, or its plural form, elements, are nouns. An element is an essential or characteristic part of something abstract. Abstract means not physical, more like an idea. So the elements of something abstract are the different things about that thing that make it. That thing. So <laughs> hip hop being made up of the elements,、uh, dance and culture and the other things I forgot. Those are its、mm -hmm. different elements. They make it that thing. They make it hip hop. 嗯，所以老师刚刚讲的句子，其实嘻哈文化有四个重要的元素：有音乐、派对、艺术，还有舞蹈。So maybe let's talk about the music first. Sure.、Mm -hmm. The music people. DJs bring hip hop to people's ears. They each have their own style and music tricks. They all keep people dancing, though. Oh, so here, saying though, this actually is a common usage in Korean language. For example, I think he lied to me. I could be wrong, though. Hmm. Hmm. Is he lied to me? But it's possible that I lied to him. This sometimes in online writing, we turn into th. Oh, so lazy. Yeah. So in the test, we have to write the original th. Oh, so lazy. Yeah. So in the test, we have to write the original th. Oh, so lazy. 好，所以在文章说，意思音乐这方面呢，就是有关 DJ。所以 DJ 呢，他们会把嘻哈音乐带到别人的耳朵里，然后每个人都有自己的风格跟音乐技巧。不过就是可以让我们跟着很想跳。It makes you wanna dance. It really does.、Mm -hmm. Even though I'm not a good dancer, I can't help but move my body when I listen to hip hop、yeah. music. So we've used the word DJ a few times now. A DJ is a person who makes music. A DJ often uses a computer to put different sounds together to make beautiful music. Well, back to the article and now about the parties. The party people, MCs, keep the party going. They get people excited by using the DJ's music and their own rhymes. 所以这篇文句是看到 excited 这一个字，我们今天先进到 Magic Box 看一下现在分词跟过去分词的用法。好的，同学们，大家好，又到了每周星座的时间了。好的，双鱼座的朋友呢，这个礼拜呢，你可能会觉得有点无聊，生活不太刺激，觉得哎，上班上课让你好累哦。但事实上呢，有很多你可能保持兴趣的事情呢，正在等你了，所以呢，千万别忘了保持信心哦。
You may feel bored this week. You may have some tiring homework. However, things you might be interested in will appear. 嗯，这句话呢，到底暗藏了什么玄机呢？就让我国师唐奇阳来为您指点迷津喽。好的，今天呢就要来跟大家分享一下哦，如何使用动词的分词来当做形容词哦。所谓动词的分词呢，在这边说的是现在分词 v i n g 以及过去分词 v p p。OK， 现在呢分词哦当做形容词用是指这件事情或这个东西呢，让人觉得怎么样？用来呢形容东西。举个例子好了，双鱼座的朋友呢，本周呢可能遇到一些状况，像是呢你看了一场。电影，但是呢，这个电影很无聊。OK， 这个时候呢，你就可以说 The movie was so boring. The movie was so boring. OK， 这部电影好无聊哦。OK， 所以呢，在这边我们使用 boring。boring 呢，就是呢 bored v i n g 现在分词形式，它就能用来形容东西，也就是电影呢很无聊。那么呢，如果我们使用的是呢过去分词哦，过去分词的动词过去分词呢，就是可以指某人觉得怎么样。用来呢形容人的感受，像是呢你看电影的时候觉得怎么样？超无聊的。这个时候呢，我们就可以把人当做主词了。I felt bored when I was watching the movie. I felt bored when I was watching the movie. OK， 我看电影的时候觉得怎么样？觉得好无聊哦。OK， bored 就是呢过去分词，它呢就用来形容人，也就是形容哦我本人觉得很无聊。那这两个字呢？如果用相反了 ，a 意思大不同喽。如果呢，我说怎么样 ，I am boring, I am boring， 这样子呢，是指哦，哎，不是我觉得无聊，而是呢，我这个人，我的人格呢，是很无聊的。哎，老师呢，很有聊的，千万呢，别讲错。我们现在分词、过去分词要形容好，不然下次呢，我就不直播，不跟你报告这礼拜的星座运势喽。好的，现在呢，我们来看一下同学的留言呢、哦。这边呢，有位同学留言说：“哎，老师，还有一些动词跟 bored。” Boring 的用法很相似哦，哎，不要着急哦，哎，其他的呢类似用法、哦，还有比方说 excited，excited excited, 感到兴奋的形容人，和 exciting 令人兴奋的。比方说呢，我说 the exciting video made all of us feel excited. OK， 这部呢很令人兴奋的影片呢，让我们所有人呢都很兴奋。注意到、哦，一样是过去分词形容人觉得怎么样，现在分词呢形容东西让人觉得怎么样。还有呢，什么样的动词呢？我们可以看到 tired 感到疲倦的，和 tiring 令人疲倦的。Surprised, 感到惊讶的，和 surprising 令人惊讶的、哦。我们要记好的是什么呢？现在分词哦是用来形容事物，过去分词呢是用来形容感受，就很简单啦。最后考考大家了，身为星座专家，我对研究星座很有兴趣。I am 什么样 ？In studying star signs. OK， 我们这边呢要填入 interesting 还是 interested 呢？没有错，答案呢就是 I am interested in studying star signs. 以上呢就是我们双鱼座的本周运势。接下来我们看看水瓶座。所以老师刚刚的句子有 rhyme 这个字，它就是押韵词的意思。所以这个 MC 呢，其实就是 master of ceremonies， 它就是节目主持人的意思。它就是让派对继续的进行，然后他们透过使用 DJ 的音乐呢，跟他们的韵韵律，让大家觉得啊，好开心哦。Master of ceremonies， <笑> such a fancy name， huh？ <笑> MC is much easier to say. Okay， sorry. Yeah， no， it's great. It's great to tell them what that means. Actually， I sometimes forget that that means. That an MC is basically just a host, right? Yeah, yeah. Somebody who. 节目主持人 Yeah, it's it's kind of what we're doing, right? Oh yeah. We're so MCs. We're MCs. <laughs> okay. Well, back to the article, and now we're moving on to the art. The art graffiti is a style of street art. Graffiti artists use colorful paints to show how they feel. 哦，所以这边我们出现今天要讲艺术，接下来这一点，那我们也看到这个单词 artist， 我们先看一下它的意思。Artist 就是艺术家的意思。那我们刚刚也说，我们讲到艺术，所以其实艺术这一个字就是就是 art。那我们也可以把它变成形容词，变成很有艺术感的或艺术天分的，就是 artistic。比如说 ，his art 
artistic talents were wasted in his boring job. 他的艺术天分呢被他那个枯燥的工作给浪费了。那我们再看一个句子 ：Leonardo da Vinci is one of the most famous artists in history. 就是里奥纳多呢，达文西，他是历史上最有名的艺术家之一。Artists and art. An artist is a person who creates art. But what is art? Well, this is a question that people have been arguing about for thousands of years. An artist can be a person who makes sculptures or who paints pictures, or an artist can be a person who makes music. There are many different kinds of artists because there are many different kinds of art. 嗯，所以这个字，这个、像老师你刚刚那个文章，我们出现 colorful 这个单字，那我们就进下一个卡，看一下 colorful 这个字。colorful 这个单字超级好记的，对不对？因为你看到 color 后面加上 full， 你就知道是颜色鲜艳的，然后颜色很缤纷的。因为像另外一些字啊，还有 beautiful， 其实也是 beauty 加上 f u l。变成 beautiful， 或者是 wonder 加上 f u l 变成 wonderful， 所以这些字都是蛮像的。所以除了当色彩缤纷以外呢，你也可以当什么东西很丰富。比如说 ，the city has a colorful history， 就是这个城市呢有丰富多彩的历史。那我们再看一个句子 ，Jimmy drew a colorful picture with pink, pink。Blue and yellow markers. Jimmy 呢，他用粉红色、蓝色还有黄色的麦克笔画了一张色彩缤纷的图片。So as Chicklin explained, something colorful is full of color. If something's colorful, it usually contains many different bright colors. But actually, we can use colorful to describe something that is one color, but that color is super bright. A rainbow is a colorful thing that's full of different colors, or you could be wearing a colorful T-shirt. Chicklin,、mm -hmm. what does it mean if somebody says you have a colorful personality? Um, um, does that mean that you are very? I don't know how to say that. I don't know how to describe it. I don't know. I think it means you're very maybe quad thumb. You know, like that person、okay. has a very exciting personality, but、okay. sometimes maybe it's a bit too much. Oh, okay. So, do you think it's a little negative? A little negative, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, he can just be like, as I just said, just a bit more exaggerated. Ah, so, like me. You are you? Ah,、uh, yeah. Sometimes, yeah. Really? I, I'm colorful. Well, I think you're colorful just in a very nice way. Thank you, Jacob. <laughs> OK， 所以老师刚刚讲这字，大家也可以记一下。那刚刚讲到艺术，艺术呢，他们讲到 graffiti 就是那个涂鸦，所以涂鸦呢是街头艺术的一个风格。那当这个涂鸦的艺术家，他们使用五颜六色的颜颜料来表达他们的感受。So graffiti is interesting, right? Because graffiti is a form of art, but it's kind of illegal, right? Uh, uh -huh. Because painting on the side of somebody's building. Could get you in trouble. Yeah, but well, then there are some areas for you where you can legally paint,、mm, yeah. or maybe you can、mm. apply for some kind of license to paint、oh. in this place. Yeah. Well, moving on now to the fourth element of hip hop, the dance. Break dancing is a dance style that was created for hip hop music. B boys <laughs> and B girls use their strength and creativity to blow people away. <laughs> Wow, beautifully written. Before we talk about b boys and b girls, let's talk about break dancing. We did mention this earlier in the article. Break dancing is a kind of dancing where the dancer usually moves around on the floor. They hop and skip and slide and spin around. And these people who do break dancing are called b boys or b girls. It means break boys or break girls because they are break dancers. 嗯哼，所以呢，老师刚刚的句子有出现 strength 这个字就是力量或实力的意思。然后另外有看到 creativity， 这是创造力。所以如果一个人很有创意，你可以说一个人很 creative。比如说 ，Reese is a creative artist. Stop. That、mm、his -hmm. <laughs> 动词就是 create, and that means somebody creates art. 代表你可以创造艺术的意思。好，那下面又出现另外一个片语，非常口语，常常用，就是 blow someone away， 指的就是。Something is so amazing,、mm -hmm. and that blows you away. 就是使你大为惊讶的很好的东西 Yeah, it's not actually being blown away by a wind. <laughs> it's being amazed by something incredible. 
Mm -hmm. So, as Chicklin mentioned, the words strength and creativity were used here. Strength is a noun. It's how strong you are. If you have a lot of strength, you can lift heavy things, and you need strength to do break dancing because you need to hold your body in different positions. Creativity is also a noun. The ability to be creative, to come up with new and interesting ideas or ways of doing things. To be creative in dance means to move your body in new and exciting ways. 嗯哼，所以我们文章最后一个元素就是舞蹈。那这个里面这个跳舞风格叫做 break dancing， 它是一种嘻哈音乐创造的舞蹈风格。所以老师刚刚提到，会跳这些的舞者呢，男生就是 b boys， 女生是 b girls， 所以用他们用他们的力量跟创造力，让大家觉得哇，好棒，好厉害哦。Have you ever seen break dancing live? Yeah, I I have a few friends that do. Break dancing. That's so cool. Yeah, it's very cool, and I think it's very difficult to、mm -hmm. do that. Yeah, they spin so fast in circles, and sometimes they stand on their heads. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, I live close to、uh, Maji Square in、uh -huh. Taipei in Yuanshan, and there are always people there at night time break dancing and doing other kinds of dance、mm -hmm. too. And sometimes I just like to watch them because、yeah. they're so skillful in the way that they move. Yeah. Well, that's all we have for day one about break dancing and hip hop. Let's go to our activity time. Review time. So let's play a game of fill in the blanks using our vocabulary words from the article. Chicklin, are you ready? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Here、mm -hmm. we go. My friend has such cool blank. He always looks good. My my. He always looks good. Oh, oh! He has a not colorful style. Yeah, he has a cool, cool style. Cool style. He always looks good. Do you know people like that? Whatever they wear, they look so cute. Yeah. So unfair. That's you. Are you no, talking about you? No. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, some some people I know. Okay. Here's one more. Okay. If we're going to the party, we should probably wear some col. Did you just give me the answer? Okay, let's try another one. Okay, try another one. <laughs> My friend <laughs> likes to paint pictures. He thinks of himself as a blank. Ha 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 ha! He likes to paint, so he's an artist. Yes, he's an artist. <laughs> the most classic of artists, they paint pictures. But a person who makes music, like Chicklin, is also an artist. Thank you. Yeah, I think I am. You are too. Both、Thank、of、you. us are artists. <laughs> There are some more words for you guys to play with, fill in the blanks, and test each other's knowledge. That's all we have for today. We'll see you tomorrow for day two.、Mm -hmm. Let's mo learn more about hip hop. Hip hop gets the party started. Warm up question: What's your favorite style of music? Why do you like it? Hip hop is a style of music and a way of life. Hip hop culture has four important elements. Music, parties, art, and dance. The music people. DJs bring hip hop to people's ears. They each have their own style and music tricks. They all keep people dancing, though. The party people. MCs keep the party going. They get people excited by using the DJ's music and their own rhymes. The art. Graffiti is a style of street art. Graffiti artists use colorful paints to show how they feel. The dance. Break dancing is a dance style that was created for hip hop music. B boys and B girls use their strength and creativity to blow people away. Word power. Style, style. I love the style of Nancy's house. It's simple but interesting. I love the style of Nancy's house. It's simple but interesting. Element, element. This movie had all the elements. Of a good action movie. This movie had all the elements of a good action movie. Artist, artist. 
Art. Art. Leonardo da Vinci is one of the most famous artists in history. Leonardo da Vinci is one of the most famous artists in history. Colorful, colorful. Jimmy drew a colorful picture with pink, blue, and yellow markers. Jimmy drew a colorful picture with pink, blue, and yellow markers. 电视字会 Rhyme, rhyme, strength, strength, creativity, creativity.